Hello princesses and welcome back to Not Fit for Print Beauty with me, Rebecca. Well today as you can see I have quite happily fished my Posh is Back shirt out of a drawer. So excited to wear it on camera again today to celebrate the fact that, well, Posh is back. We have four new shades of Victoria Beckham Posh lipstick. The first release was, oh, well under a year ago and had about, oh, nine or ten, I think nine shades. And Victoria Beckham Beauty has introduced four new ones. I picked up three of them. I picked up Fire... Uh, spark and jump. I just left out twist, which I'll show you a photo of. Why did I not pick up all four? Frankly, I have no idea. <laughs> These three just really appealed to me. So I do want to take a look at them and try them on today with you and talk about how they fit in with the other nine shades in case you have any of those already and you're wondering about comparisons. I have no concern at all about how they feel on the lips as I know from the first release they are comfy shiny smooth that kind of perfect hybrid between a lip a lipstick and kind of a um like a lip shine so they feel beautiful on the lips so moisturizing and typical of Victoria Beckham beauty and Victoria Beckham's aesthetic in general. They are just kind of a very minimalist stylish easy to wear look that's kind of her signature. So these little guys, the four new ones, just like the first nine, are $38 each. And like I said, four shades that I picked up, three. So let's start. We're going to double lip swatch all of them and compare them a little bit. The first one I want to look at is Jump. I have a single layer already of that on my lips, but we're going to build it up a little bit. And I'm also going to show you it. This one also has one that it kind of looks similar to, kind of. So let's take a look at it on my arm. Here is Jump right there. And I just kind of wanted you to see it real quickly. And in my head, and I don't know, maybe in the swatch it won't look quite as similar, but in my head it looks somewhat similar to Sway from the very first release of the first nine. So let's take a look and see how correct I am or not. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, Sway right there is a little bit... Um, has a little bit more purple in it, maybe a little bit more red, I should say. So again, here is the new shade Jump, and it is, in my estimation, most similar to Sway if you remember that from the first. Jump on the left, sway on the right. Let's try it on a little bit together. Here is jump on my lips already, just one little swipe of it, and I wanna show you it more. Now the way this works, of course, is we have our same tortoise shell, same as the first release, the beautiful Victoria Beckham tortoise shell, and snap, if you could hear that. This stays really nicely in your bag, won't come apart. It rolls up and rolls down. I never thought I would be saying that about a lipstick, but then Charlotte Tilbury came out with those hyaluronic happy kisses that didn't roll back down. So now, for some reason, I feel I've got a state when they roll back down. So here we go. We have an embossed VB, if the camera is picking that up, and we're gonna do another layer of jump. You can see the shine as I apply it. so comfortable, such a pretty, almost like a little bit of a pinkish neutral, and of course you can give it more staying powder power by applying one of Victoria Beckham's famous liners underneath, which I love as well, but this is just unadulterated so that you can see the shade. This is just jump on its own. You can even put the lip liner over the top if you want it, mattifies it a little bit, and blends in the shade if you would like to do that. Well, you can do that with any lip liner, but I like to do it with Victoria Beckham's. As you can see, it's wearing easily. I put it on quite easily as well. I want to switch now, and let's look at Fire and Spark. So let me take this off and come right back. Stay right there. Okay, I want to move on now to what's actually probably my favorite of the new releases and might even be my favorite of all the 13 of the entire collection, and that is Spark. So I'm wearing one layer of Spark now. We're starting to go a little bit towards the red side of town, which will make you think of Pop, uh, the original red in the original collection, but Pop was very much a blue red, and we're not going there with these two redder shades. So I have left on my arm, I have left Jump. I took off 
sway because we don't want to get confused. But I have left jump and here we're going to look at spark right next to it. So spark is going a little bit bricker in color, more of a brick color. And I have, so we have jump and spark. Spark gets a little bit more of a brick color and I currently have spark on my lips one layer again just to get us started and I thought we would apply it together a little bit more. So let's take a look. Very pretty, not really what I would call a red, but almost if a red could be a neutral, I think this might do it. Like I said, if a red could be a neutral. Again, extraordinarily comfortable, very easy to wear, very pretty, and very minimalist, very Victoria Beckham. So I want to now come back and do fire, which is her orangiest red, her most fiery. Um, it would be to pop, to pop is blue red, as fire is going to be to the orange red. Let's take a look at it right now. Okay, as you see, I already have one layer of fire on and we're already spicing things up. So again, this will be compared right away to Pop, but Pop is its blue red cousin. And this is definitely pretty orange red. I only put on one quick layer. We're gonna build it up together. So I don't think it's very neat on my lips right now, but let's take a look at the swatch. Here it is in the bullet. It is definitely an electric poppy orange red. And I'll put it right here, though it bears no resemblance to its little sister shades. But just because these are the ones I bought, here is Jump, here is Spark, and here is Fire. Again, Fire, the orange red cousin to Pop. Last releases uh, Radiant, Radiant and Deep Blue Red. Let's try on a little bit more of Fire. Wow, that really packs a punch, as you can see. And I like this super creamy formula. Look at the difference putting on a lot versus one little layer. So one little layer almost acted like a lip shine. And now we're seeing much more of a saturated lipstick color. I like it because sometimes when you put on a very uh, bright or deep color like this, dark color like this, saturated color, it will find lip lines that you never knew you had. And because this is such a creamy, gentle formula, as you see, I'm gonna smile for you big, you're really not seeing it. I'm not saying that I couldn't go in with a brush and neaten it up, because of course I could. But as you see, it still is very easy and quick. I like easy and quick to apply and still very, very pretty. So loving, loving the new shades. Loving that I got to take back out my Posh is Back t-shirt. Want to know if you heard about this release. And if you are considering getting a few of them, or I hope this video helped you if you are, they're very, very different shades, except I think for Jump, which looks a little bit like Sway, but even then, not too much. So definitely comment below and let me know if you're picking up any of these. I would love to hear your thoughts. Such a comfortable, beautiful lipstick, $38 each. Uh, let me know. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I sure hope that you did. And if you haven't already done so, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.